Welcome to the Pie Shed. This video has got nothing to do with Raspberry Pi though. It's uh, all to do with an app called Orasma. Orasma is a cool app uh, for iOS that you can use to move across pieces of work and see video feedback. And I'm going to give you an example of that and how it works, how it could potentially work in the classroom now. So on the left I've got my mobile phone set up with Orasma on and I've created a channel called this Gold Brunellian. So it's useful if you create a channel first. Uh, and if I click on my channel, I've got no auras here, it's absolutely blank. So what I want to do is create a new one, so I'm going to tap on there now, and it's asking for a overlay. So this is the piece of footage that you'd like to show once you um, move your phone over a, a, a successful aura. So I've recorded a piece of, um, a piece of video, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add a new piece of video from my phone. And it's this particular one here. So if I play that. When moving the phone over a piece of work in the classroom, this piece of video footage could either be the student talking about the work or it could be feedback from the teacher for the student. So I'm going to use that as an overlay. Okay, and I'm going to call this one feedback. So at this point, I'm creating an aura. Okay, so there it is feedback. When moving the phone over a piece so of work. That's just confirming. The this piece of video footage, footage so I'm going to select it and it's saying or it's asking for a trigger image so what image would I like to um, move my phone over to see that piece of video footage so if I move it over this piece here you'll see this icon goes either green and bro red but before you click it must be on green otherwise it won't work so I'm just snapping that now when moving the phone over a piece of work in the classroom this piece of video footage could either be the student talking about the work or it could be feedback from the teacher for the student. So now that aura is set up within my device. This piece of video footage could either be the student talking about the work or it could be feedback. <coughs> so click feedback. And I'm going to make this one public. And I'm going to add it to my school channel. It's quite important that you do that. So now on my channel I have the aura listed there so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you how uh, a parent or a student would actually get to their auras um, really useful for things like open evening and I'll show you how they'll get it on their mobile device imagine now that this on the left the iPad on the left is the device that you're going to uh, parents using for instance and we've still got the piece of work on the right so within Orasma you would advise students or parents to search for um, the channel. So my channel was called the Score Brunellian, so you'd have to have some instructions to that effect um, in the classroom. So I'm searching for that channel, and there it is. So I found it, and now I'm going to follow that channel. I've looked one before, so there we go, you're following the Score Brunellian. So now it shows the auras that are listed at the bottom, but we can't access those until we move um, the device over. A particular piece of work. So now imagine you're in the classroom as a parent and you move your iPhone over when a piece of work. When over a piece of work in the classroom, this piece of video footage could either be the student talking about the work or it could be feedback from the teacher for the student. When moving the phone up. There you go. So that would be quite powerful if you've got a display full of uh, student work and the students are talking about the work themselves. Um, could be quite cool for open evening. Um, parents could see a, a, an array of work and similarly for students if you want to do um, a really cool feedback session then you could have uh, a feedback channel um, that all students could access through their devices and they could get video feedback or personalized feedback um, at home hope you find it useful